With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello student, the question is a pair of dice is thrown six times. If getting a total of seven is considered a success, find the probability of at least five successes. Okay, so let's look at the solution. Okay. We know that a dice have numbers from 1 to 6. Okay, so a pair of dice is thrown. So total cases would be total possible cases are 6 into 6 that is 36 ways. Okay. Now out of these 36 ways we have to get a total of 7. Okay, we have to get the cases the cases which gives which gives a total of 7 are okay it can be 1 1 and 6 it can be 2 and 5 it can be 3 and 4 it can be 4 and 3 it can be 5 and 2 and it can be last 6 comma 1 okay these are the only cases by which we can get the sum of 7 okay so these are 1 2 3 4 5 6 cases okay so probability of getting a total of 7 would be equal to 6 divided by total cases that is 36 so it becomes 1 by 6 Okay, so suppose this is denoted by small p that is probability of success probability of success so this is 1 by 1 by 6 okay so total getting a total of 7 is considered a success okay so we have denoted that small p so probability of not get probability of failure probability of failure would be 1 minus 1 by 6 this becomes 5 by 6 okay now we have to we have to get probability of at least 5 successes in 6 times so this is a trial probability so we we'll, we can use binomial here using binomial distribution okay the probability of success in each trial is 1 by 6 and probability of failure in each trial is 5 by 6 so probability of success capital x equal to x times probability of success x times in n trials is given by ncx p to the power x and q to the power n minus x so here it becomes equal to n is here we have we are throwing pair of dice six times so n is six here so six c okay now we have to get probability of at least five successes okay so total probability is total probability is at least five successes so first case is of five successes so this is 6 c 5 probability of success that is 1 by 6 to the power 5 and 5 by 6 to the power 6 minus 5 that is 1 okay and second case is probability of six successes so 1 by 6 to the power 6 and 5 by 6 to the power 6 minus 6 that is 0 so this becomes 6 into 5 divided by 6 to the power 5 plus 1 that is 6 plus this is 1 and 1 divided by 1 to 12, 1 divided by 6 to the power 6 so this becomes equal to 6 into 5 30 plus 1 31 divide by 6 to the power 6 so this is our final probability thank you 
for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.